Welcome back, all you glorious bastards. Got another watch along here. BP crew, that is. Doing everybody's favorite, the original Mortal Kombat. Following some guy. I already forgot his name. Andy something. Christopher Lambert. Christopher Lambert yeah, from... Peter Jason. Peter Jason Sounds from fun. Village of the Damned to now Mortal Kombat in Arguably that order. Arguably the best Mortal Kombat. Movie? Mm-hmm. Besides maybe some of the animated stuff and the new remake You're and amazing. Mortal Kombat 3 Annihilation Part 2. I'm sorry to say. Hard to say. I said it. There's a lot of gold there. We will be doing the entire Mortal Kombat extended universe. And Just I'm Scott. Oh, I'm Leon. I'm Robert. And that's it. No Jake today. No, I'm just kidding. I'm up. I'm Jake. You fucking, I swear to God. It's funny when I do it. I'm Jake. I guess with that being said, I'll guide you in nice and gently. Oh, yeah. This uh, 1994 Mortal Kombat to sync this audio track up to your copy of Mortal Kombat with a K. Simply pause this audio track when prompted. Is there so a Mortal Kombat with a C? Well, it doesn't. Is it combat spelled with a C? Well, it's supposed to be, but we'll talk about that when we started, <laughs> right? <laughs> That's fair. So. Play your copy of Mortal Kombat, the 1994 Christopher Lambert joint. When you get to the 15 second mark and the new line cinema logo fades completely to black, unpause this audio track and you will be good to go. So again, pause this audio track when prompted. Play your copy of Christopher Lambert's Mortal Kombat. At the 15 second mark, when the New Line Cinema logo fades completely to black, restart this audio track, and you will be all sank it up. Sounds good. So go ahead and pause in three, two, one, pause. And we're back. Mortal Kombat, they're already New Line Cinema song. presents. I don't even care. Boo doo boo doo boo doo boo doo boo boo. So the reason they had to go with the K is they went with the C, but they got turned down because it's too uh, generic of a term. Oh, couldn't copyright it. Yeah, so that's why there's so many products with in the United States that spell Z's instead of S's and K's and shit. It's just to get around the copyright. Yeah, oh, that sounds about right. Yeah. An extreme with an X instead of the, you know. However you spell extreme. Yeah, because that gets around copyright. I get you, I get you. America has, like, the stupidest copyright laws. It makes us look really dumb. It, well, a lot of things make us look dumb. Trump makes us look dumb. <laughs> copyright laws. Who's this 10-year-old? That's Luke King's brother. He's actually the chosen one. He didn't do very well. He really doesn't. He does incredibly poorly. Especially since he's been training his whole life by secret monks. It seems like... Why would why would they be fighting at Angkor Wat? That <laughs> is that this Buddhist temple or whatever? Yeah, Angkor Wat. What? What? I have no idea. Probably because it looks cool. It because you don't have really to build cool. a set, and it's like instant production value. Oof! The cost to get everyone here is probably that's why it's just the two of them. <laughs> you know, it's just these two guys well, fighting in front of a green screen. screen. <laughs> yeah, and green screened. You could see the composite on that, because there's like the sky composite in the background, them composite in the front, over yeah. whatever that building was called. Mortal Kombat! Close enough. The KDMF song. That literally was like the soundtrack to my childhood. <laughs> oh, that's so sad. Yeah, I had this old ass fucking PlayStation 1 my dad would let me play on. And he had like Mortal Kombat 3 or something on that. Who okay, came? Brother, dead. <laughs> you pay per word. <laughs> so, 
Sonia. This is a uh, Wendy's uh, directed by Wendy's uh, daddy and Mila Jovich's little baby girl or, or baby daddy. Really? Yeah. Paul W. S. Anderson also. Uh, Event Horizon. We watch a lot of his movies. Yeah. Fifth Element. Yeah. Is Fifth Element? Best Christmas movie ever. Soldier, Resident Evil, AVP. We're about to branch off into the Soldier. Three Musketeers I saw in there. Oh, shit. Pompey, he tried. Oh, no. That was bad. The new Death Race. The new one? Yeah. Nice. I'm Jason Statham, I am. <laughs> Damn it. Still an accurate interpretation. I can't take all the credit for that. I mean, I did make it up, but by that I mean I got it from uh, Adam Plays, their Adam and Pals watch alongs. Is that from him? Yeah, well, Scott. He makes the joke. Oh. And it really makes me laugh because he's really good at it and he does it way better than I do. <laughs> I don't know. I thought, I thought yours was pretty spot on, but. I'm, I'm doing like the impression of him doing the impression. So it's like. Did you see that crazy wink? Well, he's only got one eye. Well, no, I know, but why is his other eye all twitchy? Does he need two robot eyes? Huh. Laser beam eyes are cool. That's one of the powers I would go for. You're never going to see laser beam eyes coming. Nope. Look me in the eye if you dare you to say that or something like that, and you just laser beam directly in the eye. <laughs> wing! Ah, fuck! All of, all of these people completely unaffected by the uh, gunfire... Right behind them. You think you'd hear screaming and somebody running away? I can't believe you had a slug in that. Just blow a guy's arm off. Johnny Cage. Hyper uppercut. Wait. That's. Right. Of fire. Whatever. Yoga Flame. I wasn't allowed to play too many fighting games when I was a kid. Just the one. But nunchucks. You didn't see that coming. I brought a gun. Bo, 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 bo. Oh, shit. He's already dead. Where'd you get these jokers from? (laughs) Beat up a whole group of guys with cattle prods tonight. It's pretty cool. <laughs> One of them had nunchuckers. Oh, did it? Oh, okay. I did see the expanding staff, which is like the dumbest weapon ever. But... Only if you want to, like, hit something. <laughs> Boo! Jesus. <laughs> Very Spielbergish. The fuck? Raiden. (laughs) (laughs) So this is the guy we're actually following. Yeah. From, um, obviously, everybody's favorite, whatever the last movie we watched was. Oh, Uh, either they lived. Village of the Damned. Oh, yeah. Either they lived or Village of the Damned. He looks like. I have trouble remembering. That old mountain man guy. Why can't I think of his name? The the guy who had a bear. Yeah. The, the brawny guy. Mm. Pretty close. I don't think the brawny guy had a bear though. That's. I'm pretty sure the brawny guy was a bear. <laughs> it was like his whole thing. I like how they don't send like a pretty woman or anything. It's. Just this random schmuck. 
<laughs> Turns out he is a pretty woman. Oh, wait, it's Shanks said, never mind. What is the name of that mountain man? That's going to bother me. Paul Bunyan? No. What? Oh, he was a lumberjack. It, it's all right. Is that the brawny guy's name? Mm. Is his name Kit? Kit something? Mm. <laughs> Kit Fisto. <laughs> Kit was the name of, uh, what's his face's car? Mm. Knight Riders? Yeah. Mr. Fisto. Michael Knight. <sighs> Have they rebooted that yet? I think so, yeah. We should definitely do that. Oh, the TV, the reboot TV show that probably <laughs> lasted like a season. A uh, season. It's probably 20 episodes long. All of oh, them an hour. If they even bothered to make that many. Those shows, oftentimes, they'll make six and then wait to see how well they do. Hmm. There's really sick or swim with those, huh? You get seasons on Netflix for mediocre numbers. They're making another Shine movie. <laughs> There's so few movies I can't sit through, right? There's only a handful that I've ever walked out of or never finished. And that was one of them. The Shine one, the Will Smith, Fairies Are Real, or whatever movie. You mean by that you just stopped the movie? Because yeah, exactly. Netflix. Okay. Because I was like, I'd watch it for like half an hour, 45 minutes, and be like, oh my god, click, click. I don't know how many movies I've ever walked out on. I walked out of the Borat movie. I know... I know I've said this before, but my father walked out of uh, 2001 A Space Odyssey. That movie's boring as shit. Well, to be I've fair... I've never even watched it all the way through. To be fair, my dad did not think it was a science fiction movie. He thought it was a movie about monkeys and was terribly <laughs> disappointed that it was We're the monkeys! Yeah! Oh, you lying fucking bastard! <laughs> I wonder right. how long he sat through the space part expecting them to find the monkey people. And Does it with start them? with the monkey people? Is yeah. that like how yeah. the movie starts? It yeah. literally starts with the monkey <laughs> Yeah, people. so it's like two minutes at the beginning and then it goes to the space and he's like, yeah. oh my god. No. No, this can't be. No. <laughs> so you're long man, my monkeys. If the monkeys aren't back, I'm leaving. It's probably like that. That's how long it takes for them to dock that fucking spaceship. It's like an extended space scene. Even the parts with the monkeys felt really long. <laughs> yes. But I, I didn't get very far in that movie. Yeah, again, I've never watched it all the way through. Is this the Highlander? This is Raiden. An Asian face? That's just what he looks like. You think he's squinting? No. That's just what he looks like. And this is a, a treasure to my people. This is Christopher Lambert. Oh, this is the guy I've been making fun of the whole time. Is his name Christopher? That's what I was saying, right? Yeah. I think I got it right. Not sure. Christopher Lambert joint. He, um, he also voices over his own lines in the French version. That's cool. Yeah, because he's bilingual. I heard this one too. He had such a good time making this. He didn't make any money off the movie because he like flew people out on private jets and threw parties and stuff. Yeah. So it was just like he basically did it for a wash just to like hang out and fucking yeah. be in the movie. <gasps> Exciting. Well, I kind of like how there was like uh, thunder when he moves. That's kind of cool. They were planning because they couldn't afford him to um, do a. A stand-in for a bunch of scenes. And he's like, no, fuck it. I'll show up. I'll do it. You don't have to pay me more. <laughs> and he, including, flew, flew out to whole, you know, other countries and sets he wasn't even going to be part of just to be there. And uh, he apparently, him and uh, the director got along well. Oh, that's funny. Yeah. Introduced him to Milovich. <gasps> Everyone was shocked that he just said that. I wasn't listening. What happened? He just said he was going to go... Fight the tournament? Find his brother's killer in the tournament. Kumate. Did we already do blood sport? No. Kumate. Kumate. As a kid, I always sat there going, who? Hey. Who? Hey. <laughs> I never heard Kumate. Tong Po. Kumate. Tong Po. Hey. Wait, isn't it Tong Po? Nah. Or am I thinking of blood sport? Isn't that what we're talking about? Yeah. It's a Kumate. It's like a song about Maybe the I'm thinking of Kickboxer. It's hard to say. He has three or four movies that are yeah. literally exactly like that. I remember I was commenting because he wraps his hand in 
bandages and it dips them in glass, but that's done in like two different movies. Of that was wasn't that one of the Rambo movies? Didn't wasn't know. didn't that end up being not even a real thing? Because we watched the Rambo movie it was supposed to be, and then he doesn't even do it in that. It's like a Hot Shots Part Two. Yeah, I think they're off. probably maybe combining the fight scene that he's talking oh, about. Oh, okay, maybe well. that's why it wasn't in the the Rambo one. Yeah, it was like oh, okay, and that the would Rambo make sense. They do the stick fighting. Well, how, how much money? <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah. This is mean. Like, you really don't know what's in there. And he took the money. Why not just not take the money? It's like, I'm a fighter, jerk. Why not just not assume that somebody walking down the dock is your luggage boy? Uh, yeah. I don't know. You just yeah, it was maybe a dick move, but you, you really don't know it was in that man's. You no, know, I need help because he's still got a bunch of bags. Look, and he's got guys carrying all the rest of his luggage. You don't understand how heavy that was. It could have been his medication. <laughs> I'm diabetic, type one. Did he say kitten? You've got to be kidding me. Is that what it said in the subtitles? That's not what I heard. I can't carry all these bags myself. Why did I bring so many bags? It's like, oh man, the 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 last thing I owned from my dead brother who was killed by some sort of weird space alien wasn't that bad. <laughs> some sort of shape-shifting wizard. Yeah, thanks, Jax. It's weird that he's in this. I guess the second or third game had probably already been out by the time they made this movie, right? Yeah. His name's not Jax, isn't it? Jackson? And, like, Jax is what it, it's short for? Him? Probably. I thought? Probably. Okay. Well, I mean, that's the same thing. <sighs> His nickname's Jax. Right to the water, both bags. See, she's got a gun. How's that for Mortal Kombat? Oh, sure, I'll fight you to death. Blam, 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 blam. Okay, where does it say I can't use a gun? Um, this was supposed to be Cameron fucking Diaz. Oh, shit. She broke her fucking wrist. Training for this? Yeah, training for this. It's like, oh, man, I would have liked to have seen that movie. She's so crazy hot at this point in time, too. And her all, like, fight fit. Yeah. Oh, it would have been like her in like fucking Charlie's Angels, basically. Yeah, she's a she's a looker in that one for sure. Yeah, but she's got a weird face. It's her true. dressed all in black, like you can't even really make out anything. Well, that's only just this part. She gets into a, a different outfit later. Hi, Mister Sue. Right, I'm an immortal shape shifting wizard, and I still think your big potato jaws hot. <laughs> She's got a more manly jaw than him. She does have a strong jaw. Yeah, no, that is goddamn. Huh. All the heroes kind of have strong jaws, though. Sub Zero. <laughs> oh, Scorpion! He was always my favorite. Um. The, Get over here. the Scorpio guy was just a stunt guy, but they liked him so much that they gave him the role. Okay. And then uh, Sub Zero is actually the highest trained martial artist on the set. Oh, ew. What is that? Is that your penis? Uh, why does it come out of your hand like that? He's like, it's don't move. We have so much trouble animating this shit if you move. Oh, I bet. Special effects. You mean he was really some sort of thunder god the whole time? Yeah. I know you don't mean that. I, you're not glad to see me. I love this man so much. 
goddamn national treasure he is. I never thought he was that good of an actor. He's like the most French Irishman ever in Highland. <laughs> you know, like what the fuck? Super creepy, right? When you get this old, there's not a whole lot to live for. Yeah, way to keep up. Where'd you, you go? Oh, great. <laughs> Look, if you can see all the, the background, you can see like a seam in the wall. Look at his head. Right above his head. A semen wall. A Ew. semen wall. <laughs> Look at how ooky it is. A what? You can see the edge of the set. You see uh, how it's supposed to, it's painted like a black knight or whatever with sparkly lights on it. But I saw a seam in it. <laughs> <laughs> a what? Semen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they needed to have like uh, a little cloth to like have yeah. a curve or something. Yeah, don't they already do stuff like that? I mean, well, I'm sure for some sets, but like you a stage never play meant to or see whatever. It. It's true. We're watching this in ultra high def, a way you were never meant to be seen. Are you sure it was a semen? Just not semen. I'm sure there's a semen in. <laughs> oh, yeah, at least we make ourselves laugh. And the, the ones of other people that watch this. <laughs> There's going to be tens. It's just one guy over and over again. I love India. And he is the best. India rocks. Woo. Why are you talking like that? And he's really trying to suppress that French accent. All right. Let's see if I can see this scene. It looks like there's folds in the curtain. Okay. Like a seam, almost? Yeah. Like there's... Yeah, a bunch of them. Is that really what they did? Just get a black There, It's got to be some sort of stage trick where it's like, probably like a black cheesecloth and they put lights behind it. And then you slightly move it or something and it twinkles. The other two will die. No, fresh air. <laughs> He's always laughed creepily. <laughs> the laugh never touches his eyes. Or sounds like a human laugh. Yeah. <laughs> All antagonistic. You know what laughter sounds like. Moving on. Then win the tournament. You're on the boat to fucking go to the tournament. What do you mean you're not ready? Mortal Kombat. The Aurora, Aurora Borealis. Is that the death mark? God damn it. The dark mark? <clears throat> <clears throat> that did look very Harry Potter-ish, yeah. Oh, 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 okay. It's pretty crappy looking shit. Pretty crappy looking island. That's a pretty crappy island. Jake's Island. There's no beaches. <laughs> exactly. Just rock face to water. Never bite island unseen. <laughs> you only make that mistake once. Yeah, you get there, it's just sheer cliff face. It literally is. Why did you bring so much luggage? She really? doesn't even have a change of clothes. There's the beach. Oh, it was just right there the whole time? There's like no waves in that water. It's kind of strange. It's all a set. <laughs> <laughs> See? Built on a soundstage. It's so deep into like a weird natural harbor that's super very nice. Ow! He says immediately.
Okay. How does she have a compass? You could have helped. She walks funny. <laughs> She's on weird boots in the sand. It's probably not normal for her. All the legends. Tell me about some of these legends. Oh, there, there you, you go. go. He, he should offer to pay some of the monks to help carry his bag baggage. <laughs> well, anybody help me carry these bags for money? Yeah. Look at how poorly rendered that is. The guy wasn't even going up steps. What the fuck? But there's special effects in the game. <laughs> this, the SNES version is at this point still. <laughs> I tried to pay you earlier. Don't fall for it. He's just going to throw another one in the water. <laughs> That'd be great. Just toss it off. <laughs> the British person's laughing at that somewhere. <laughs> In India. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Truly good, chaps. Good show. <laughs> I'm Jason Statham. <laughs> This is so stupid. It's just so poorly rendered. The reptile. Sonia, or is that Katana? That's Sonia. Uh, uh, no, no. Remember, if I remember correctly, this wasn't just a, a, a complete falsehood. The the sets for this that they built in L.A. were so large and literally looked like rubble, like on fire rubble that some of the airplanes taking off called into the tower to ask what the fuck had just happened. Like <laughs> Some sort of uh, natural disaster? No, like did a so factory realistic. explode or something where people injured, you know, that type of thing. They just were curious. Hmm. But it was just the set. And they had a, <laughs> so much of it was on fire. That's funny. Yeah. Oh, eating weird... Otherworldly foods. God, who knows what it is? Probably poi. Well, it's Ugh. probably just some sort of weird space rat or something. Who some knows? S or starfish. Uh, okay. I mean, if you didn't know what it was, it's not stomach churning. Well, I still don't think I'd eat a starfish. What if it was in like some uh, fried rice or something? Mm hmm. Okay, you got me. Yeah, yeah. Very nice starfish. What's wrong with starfish? It looks like baby corn. Mm. You never know what it was. It just it just looks funny. Well, it does. It does. It's and true. It's not like anything else exactly. It's very that alien. Eat. That yeah, that we eat at least. I think something's about to happen. Cool Marjay. Cool Marjay. Huraga. Oh, he said it. <laughs> he even said it with a K. You think they get whores and stuff at night, like uh, Enter the Dragon? Uh, yeah, they probably would. And it would be like a trick to get them like, all tired out. I didn't like the having to climb a thousand stairs to get there. Yeah. Are you going to want to do that right before your fight tournament? That doesn't seem right. Oh, exactly. That's why you would do that. You'd make them climb 18 miles up a steer, you know, a severe cliff. To go around, to go to the back side of the mountain, to go all the way down to the other side? Yeah. Like, what? It's not my fault. This is just where the term tell. Um, our people have been here and we were Yeah, they've been here, yeah, resting and... Hey, what? I was eating that! Space starfish. No, 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 no! I um, yeah, right? I wasn't even done! I'm so hungry from all that stairs and that weird boat ride. It's like the that food looked pretty good actually too. No, I'm still suspect. All right, what are we doing here? I don't remember this from the video game. Don't they even have levels where there's like monks in the back and stuff where you could like instead of just making up your own stupid shit? All right, I don't remember. I can see right up your pants. 
Man, that guy's got huge balls. <laughs> right. Free! Hey, wait, no, wait, no magic. This is a fight tournament. Well, he, he screwed the pooch really early on that. He yeah. would have, like, fallen, like, four feet in front of him. <laughs> well, look, it just flew 20 feet past him. Yeah, whether or not your ice, you're still, your momentum and trajectory is going to stay the same, right? You would hope. Apparently not. Uh, maybe he was going for Shang Tsung. Like, he thought he could maybe take him out real quick. Oh, that'd be great. Get to the tyrant. Especially from behind. Dad, do you think that got some laughs? No. People I saw this in the theater. It did not get laughs. Oh, what's wrong with him? He's born wrong. Missing a chromosome or two? Something. <laughs> Get some uh, Outback chanting going here. Gives you a diggery do. That's uh, it's frog frog singers. Bro. Mortal Kombat. <laughs> this needs to just to fucking start already. This movie's a hard 90. What? Are you not entertained? Not as entertained as I thought I would be. I also thought they would have played the song more by now, too. Oh, they didn't know that was going to be a hit. It's at the very end of the movie. It's the first movie, or the first uh, electronic dance music album to ever get a platinum. Really? Yeah. Seriously? Damn. Yeah. Jesus. KDMF. And it was from a really small studio at the time. <laughs> Why does he sound like that? He said, "Why does he sound like uh, God, the, the the Inspector Gadget's villain?" Because <laughs> I think it's the same voice actor. That long-haired, creepy guy, huh? <laughs> Hello, love. See, I don't know what some of that stuff is. I'm assuming that's a turkey, but it looked like it had too many legs. This looks like an AI art like feast or something. Turkey's got six legs and I heard that. You goddamn dog. Oh my You're just over there farting and blaming the dog. <laughs> <laughs> See look, there's still at least two turkey legs on that thing, and he's got one. Yeah. It's funny, I saw an image very much like that. But it was a turkey with, with uh, four legs <laughs> and, like, <laughs> instead. They're setting up a bunch of elements from part two. I think the Emperor shows up then and all that stuff. I think he shows up at the end of this, right? I don't remember.
Check out my laser beam live. Yes. Okay. Why? Why did he need to say that? Can't really fill it in some backstory. How many katanas are there? <laughs> right here, uh, in the tournament. Yeah. Six. It's a very common name in the world. Outer world. Yeah. Well, nothing about me, my brother, though. See, I don't know about some of this stuff. There's only one way to go. Why? There has to be. <laughs> She's good for age. Right? Age is only a number. <clears throat> There's only one way to go. What are you going to do? Go back? Uh, we're lost. Goro, could you point the way out? Did you say Thoro? Goro. 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 His name isn't like Thoreau. Thorgo. Uh, 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 wait a minute. Thogoro. It's the predator. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Uh, and now I'm blind. Why would they make reptile an actual chameleon looking thing? Just for fun. Something spit my eyes. I can't see anything. <laughs> right? I literally can't see. Because actually, the, in the American Ninja series, how colorful they made all the different ninjas. What? Uh, Why would they think that she went through there? <laughs> okay. I'm sorry, Dan. It's okay. But uh, it actually made me really like the the, the recolorize, recolorization of Scorpion, Sub Zero, Reptilian, Smoke. Yeah, I thought that was a great idea. Like, and I it, it just reminded me of the American Ninja series. So, all right, it's a win win, huh? Yeah. Like in that one, all the all the guys with bows and arrows had uh, yellow outfits. If you had a staff, you were in purple. Swords red. Oh shit! Here we go. Uh -oh. Come on, Jake. Well, hold Do on it. a second. Mortal Kombat! Boo doo doo, boo doo, boo, boo doo doo, boo boo. Oh shit. The actor for Luke Kang was also the stunt coordinator for the film. Huh. And that actually tracks, because he is an awful actor. <laughs> he doesn't look like a very good stuntman, though. Looks to be deceiving. Excellent! Excellent! The way they're dressed, though. Pizza time! <laughs> it's like, oh, different series. Cowabunger! Double kick! I can imagine people raving to this back in the day, right? Mm hmm. Doop a doop boop boop, doo doop a doop. All the goth kids. Everyone. Was universally loved. <laughs> it still is. 
I don't put together a, a like a mixtape or what what are they called? Uh, playlist. Uh, play. I don't put together a playlist without uh, some KDMF on there. That's fair. Well, at least the one song. Well, that's true. To, let's let's not cut hairs here. It's that Mortal Kombat song. That's it. I couldn't know. name another one. I ain't couldn't either. I don't even know if they're KDMF's the name of the band. I just keep saying that. I don't know if that's right. You mean they were all just right there the whole time? All right, easy. I'm gonna I'm gonna look it up. Just electrocute a bunch of them. What do they mean to you? They'll get the point. They should just put down their weapons and leave. Okay. I'm going to take this stick, though. Give it to me. They kind of probably are, <laughs> actually. I don't know. They get a lot of weapons. I don't care how good a Mortal Kombat you are. KMFDM. A, a bunch of guys keep coming at you with spears. Especially a few guys. Like three guys with spears. Jacob. I don't care how good a karate you're at. KMFDM. KM. That's what I said. KDFM. KMFDM. What's it stand for? KDFM. Well, kiss my dick, motherfucker. Kill, death, murder. For fun. Wait a minute. Two Fs. It stands for kind, near, height, fear, thy midland. Which oh. is German for kiss my dick, motherfucker. <laughs> Daichi. Which means no pity for the majority. What shitty name for a band. Well, I mean, maybe a song that might be kind of cool. Okay. And then he has to fight second and third. Why are they fighting sticks? another human? Apparently. They all look like humans. The only one who doesn't look like a human is Goro. Is this... Warm is these little dances? Yeah. Do a little dance. Look at that. Farrah here with that one. Jesus. I remember Farrah having dreads. I don't understand what just happened Micro there. Micro-dreads. He can growl. So what are the sticks... Okay. You can use them if you want to. That guy would stick real quick. Stick, 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 stick. Pocket sand. How is this a PG? How do you not get a hard R on this? They should have. It's literally Mortal fucking Kombat. I think they wanted parents to want to take their kids to it. And you can't do that if it's R. Yeah. Yeah. Fatality. I don't know if my mom ever cared if I went and saw like a rated R movie. Rated R movie. Theaters were pretty much dead when I was growing up. That's better. You have two weapons now. Right? Poke him with a sharp splintery end. Get him right in the face. You're trying to kill him. Boom! Drop kick! You don't see a lot of those. You really got to commit with a drop kick. Yeah. There's no... There's no... Half-hearted... <laughs> yeah. Drop kick. What kind of product do you use? You got a lot of volume. Oh, I use nothing but honey. Now let's get out of here. See, and this Your seems soul like cheating. It's mine. Because he didn't even beat him. He just randomly walked up to some guy. You pull it out of my stomach? It looks like he's putting something in him. Oh, wait a minute. Mmm, delicious. But he didn't. Wait. That's not even. What? 
I don't think they understand the game Mortal Kombat. Somebody if, should have played it once or twice. They should have just brought like a kid in. <clears throat> he should have used the broken end of the spear to, to fucking stab through him. And then all of a sudden they're like, fatality. Or turn into a, a dragon or something. Animality. No, no, please allow me to whip it out. This is the flower. Contra. Oh, yeah, what's that? <coughs> In my chambers. How is it so dark in there with so many things lit? Did you see that? Yeah. Two torches, eight candles. And light behind him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He wasn't, uh, this king wasn't Australian until this movie, but it, it lasted, it was so influential for now. He's still Australian. In That's the funny, in the yeah. new one? I was yeah. going to say, we should do the new one. I think that one's rated R. Oh, the games, I meant. I don't know. Oh, movie, okay. But in the games. Did he shave a big yep. heart to his chest? He's got, he's got his little treasure trail <laughs> that starts with a weird patch on it. It's like a giant penis. That he carved out of hair. She doesn't even have a knife. Ew. To ew. I thought she was going to kick him in the nuts. How is it not the Mortal Kombat song? Mortal Kombat. You got to use some of the other uh, Kiss My Dick Motherfucker songs. Oh, shit. Is this going to be some deep tracks? Here's another KDMF song. I'll bet you most of the soundtrack, if I remember correctly, is... KDMF? No, KMF, DMF. Mortal Kombat! I think this is a pirate pants. You don't see that a lot these days. She can't really take a hit very well, can she? I'm pregnant! <laughs> Did he just spit on her? Oh, it would have been great. And then he just puts his weight down and <laughs> smashes yeah. her head. Stomps back. on her. Ah, oh, she's dead. Quick to the kick to the back of the head. She's unconscious. Just punches her once. She breaks like glass. Wait, finish him. <gasps> Your soul is mine. So does, does he still get the soul? It seems like that's what's happening. Well, I mean... It, 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 it's like, why is Raiden not executing people and shit sometimes? Like, I called dibs on that one. Yeah. Well, this isn't... It's not fair that only one realm gets it. This isn't a fair fight. Well, this actually seems like a really good way to fight him. Even though he doesn't know what this thing does. But, because he can just like hide behind a tree and get it all wrapped up. This was filmed gorilla style. They were just driving past this uh, farm. And they just saw a cool forest? Yeah. Well, it's a farm. Where exactly is this on the island? I think they film in like 20 locations. That's the thing about this fucking movie. See, it's look. Boom. It's already caught up. That didn't last long at all. It's weird that it's like a thing, too. You know, that like screams and stuff. I mm -hmm. thought it was like... A hook? Yeah, what it's hook? supposed to be is just a, like a kunai. So he can like hook you and then pull you with the chain? That's, that's what I like about the second, the, the remake. <laughs> the remake, it's actually just a... Well, that didn't work well. Uh, what, did you kill it? I guess... Okay. Ah, my ass, my fucking ass. <laughs> I fell right on my tail on my ass. Okay. This looks like a reshoot for sure. I don't even think he's wearing the same shirt. There wasn't enough fights, so they had to go back and add in more fights after they were done. Just 
just behind you the whole time? He was a nice guy. Thanks. It's a nice place you got here, buddy. It's funny how much Scorpion sounds like Freddy. <laughs> Get over here, bitch. <coughs> Welcome to my nightmare, bitch. I hear some drums going. It's getting hardcore. Ah, you broke my fucking shoulder. Did you hear all those cracks? Holy shit. This is some hardcore music. It's like gore or something. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you're kicking me when I'm down. They are in the bone zone or whatever the hell this place is. Whoa! That's what do you call places like this? Oh. I call the bone zone something entirely yeah, different. Yeah, it's completely, it's where I keep all my chicken bones. What? What? It's a later making the necklaces and jewelry. Whoa. Okay. It sounds like Metalocalypse. It's like a Metalocalypse song. Disappointment. That was pretty smooth. You don't see a lot of backflip into a double kick. As wholly unnecessary as it is, it tends not to be used very much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why did I rush him? That looked like it was edited wrong, because you see like his eyes got all wide. He should have started doing something like this. And then he should have been like, what the fuck? Eyes wide. And then like rushed him and stuff happened. You didn't know I used to be a gymnast, did you? Oh, no, get down here. Should he have said get over here again? Should he still have his little thing? He should be using it like a whip or whatever, since apparently the head killed itself. He's lucky he wound up hitting the ground. As opposed to, like, impaling himself on something? No, just falling forever. All right. He doesn't know where the fuck he is. The bone zone. I don't think that's an actual thing. They brought back the actors for Raiden, Johnny Cage, and Sully Blade to voice their their skins in Mortal Kombat 11. Okay. So you can play as the versions from the movie. Oh, that's cool. I like the idea of playing Christopher Lambert in Mortal Kombat. <laughs> that sounds, doesn't surprise me. It sounds Any chance to get to be Christopher Lambert? Yeah, yeah, kind of. I'm sure there's a Highlander video game. That was good. <laughs> right. Did he just growl like a tiger or something? He like roared like a large cat? Ah, uh, yes. I remember when Scorpio was made of lava bones. <laughs> it was a simpler time. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's quite an explosion. Where'd that come from? See... Shouldn't he have turned around and thrown that onto the fire? You know what I mean? As opposed to, like, it just being inside of him when it exploded? No, I think it was supposed to be, he just, I don't know. Like, it fell out of his pocket or something. Well, that's what I'm saying, like, he just has it on him. Yeah. So he turns around and throws, puts on his sunglasses, and throws the picture onto the fire and walks out. Even though it's like, you teleported in there, how are you supposed to get out? You want me to fight a girl? I already fought today. Well, I mean, if it's like the video game, Liu Kang just fights everybody. Round one, Liu Kang. Round two, Liu Kang. Because it's Liu Kang versus... Haven't you ever played the game? Yeah, it's... it's Not how a fight tournament works? No. Not even a little bit? No. Cool match, hey! It's like, well, Liu Kang, I'm glad you're tired from fighting 16 other people. <laughs> Only four more to go until you get to the Emperor. They just, they don't even let him eat dinner. They make him climb a lot of stairs. I'm so tired. They put him in fight after fight after fight. <laughs> As these two slowly do their karate moves. Why does it keep showing the ground? What do you mean, semen? Danny Glover was considered for the role of Raiden. Oh, huh. God, that would have been fantastic. According to uh, Take a Salt with, you know, Green of Salt with it, IMDb trivia. I'm getting too old for this shit. I'm getting too old for these off world tournaments. 
What do you mean, Katana? That's enough. Finish her. That's the Emperor. She's pretty hot. Yeah, I mean, for being ten thousand years I'd, old, I'd do it for sure. I wouldn't kick her out of bed. Okay, what's going on here? Raging. Was she pretending to be the bucket guy? Bucket boy. You know he's peeing in that bucket. I would for sure. Drink my fill and then fill it up. With pee. <laughs> the element that gives him life. So what was that fight with Katana? Was that part of the tournament? I don't know. Was that just extra? I don't know. That seems stupid. Why is he walking like that? <laughs> He's got a little rash. His jaunty little step. <laughs> He's probably chafed in his crotch. He's like, oh, this feels so good. I like to have the mist on the the mist on my nethers. <laughs> right? I like the way the mist feels on my nethers. I actually didn't expect you to come in here. This is a little embarrassing. <laughs> oh, oh, I didn't. Oh. What are you doing here? <clears throat> Fuck. <clears throat> I just got out of the shower. Because he's air now. Yeah. No, I don't know. Something. Mortal Kombat. Use your magic. How are you just fist fighting him? I'd be like, magic, magic. I'm glad that door is wheelchair accessible. <laughs> You don't see a lot of those. I bet Goro or something comes down there later. No, oh, yeah, you don't see those in temples often. Well, I like how it's half ramp, half stairs. Uh oh, here we go. He's gonna do his funny little jaunty step again. Oh oh, he's gonna do the the what is it triple X thing? Triple X. What are you talking about? The people's elbow? No, the thing where he, he does this. Uh, I don't know. Who the X that. Factor. Yeah, X Factor. That's it. This is sure. Just make that up. Uh, what is it? The blonde chick. I forget her name. Britta. She's like, he no longer wants you. He, he's been to Flavor Town. He does a <laughs> gesture of yourself. Flavor Country. <laughs> what is he doing? The elements of P. I mean, yeah. Sub Zero's only weakness. A Wouldn't bucket. it be fire? How'd that happen? He threw that really hard. Yeah. Well, he looks shocked. The hard cut. Okay. How? They went out so unceremoniously. What is Both even happening? Oh, hey. Yeah. <laughs> Goro must make poopala. It's more like war stuff. Maybe that's supposed to be Goro. Hey, it works. Mike. Yeah. Oh, that'd be great. You should, I mean, this is exactly the kind of movie for something like that. Cut to like Goro on stage yelling into a mic. Bro, <laughs> yeah. With like some of the monks in the background playing drums and shit. Or go the, is it the Lost Boys Around? Sexy saxophone Goro? Oh, alright. <laughs> I can make that work. Yeah. I mean, I've seen the images. Someone's already came up with that. We give fan to GoroFan69 on furry.com. <laughs> this is way, he's all misproportion. The world. Does this guy not see what's happening? Well, I, if I remember correctly... Should have worn my brown pants. <laughs> Goro's arms are like this, aren't they? Like, right here? Like yeah, both well, of them. I think they're like one on top of the other. I don't think they come out of the same shoulder. 
It's like he's got two sets of pecs or whatever. But I don't remember his torso being so long, though. Mm -mm. I mean, they had to do it for the animatronics, I'm sure. Because you know it's just some guy in a fucking suit. And then the big animatronic unit on top or something. Yeah. Go low. You know what it seems like Goro would have really weak knees. You know, kick him in the knee, kick him in the ankle. Yeah. Because he's so top heavy. Like, knee knee capping? Yeah, exactly. He just falls over. And, oh, he's got, he'd be cruising around on all four of his arms or whatever. Like a, <laughs> some sort of weird spider thing kicking at you. But, I mean, at least it's something. Kick him in the knee. Drop kick his knee. ba -boom! Right in the knee. Uh-oh. <laughs> Get out from underneath his other arms. Yar. Why are there humans that are <laughs> cheering for Goro? Yeah, they don't know what they're doing. No, the Dark Dimension still has humans. Those guys in the red outfits are Shang Tsung's uh, guards. There it is. What are you going to do, show? I'm already finishing him. What? That's his finishing move? See, he doesn't look too bad right there. Well. How did that kill him? I like this song too. Kumate. <laughs> That's Bro, not two kids. What the fuck? Yeah. Doesn't help that he's a uh, he's a cheater. So, can he just absorb people's souls any way he wants? It seems like it. Like through his eye, through his hand, through his mouth, with his mouth. <laughs> oh, you better not lose to him. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, that situation, huh? You better win this fight. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm going to swallow your soul. <laughs> it's like, oh, oh, how do you make it sound so dirty? <laughs> your brother's inside me right now. <laughs> So many men are inside me right now. Gotta get some Sonia. Switch it up. <laughs> right? I can actually be a girl now. <laughs> this makes it so much easier. To deal with mentally, at least. He hasn't is... rushed into one fight. Yeah. Okay. I try so hard every time. It's not, you're wrong. You're just wrong. I cut my pants into shorts. <laughs> I'm cold. Can you give me a blanket? No. No. That was kind of creepy. You smell nice, though. You need Joe Bindender. <laughs> right. You're perfect, Lou. Lou, Lou, don't even kid, man. You're perfect, baby. Your brother's named Chan. <laughs> oh, Chan. Okay, I'm ready. Uh, 
I'm ready. Quit making it thunder. I'm sick of your shit. <laughs> What's this, day two? Still no sleep? <laughs> His family's got fabulous hair. I'm just going to say it. You think that's a wig? Couldn't be. Right? It's too nice. Well, I mean, that's not the best example right there. <laughs> no. It's like he's about to be struck by lightning. Let's not get over that. He'll kill you. Happened to you. I knew it. Why not her? You've known her for two days. Oh, yeah, what's your plan? Jerk! You sure sound like it. <laughs> Perfect. Wait, I told no. you I was heroic. How is that the sign of a hero? Shows bravery. Well, you can't make, can't make those kind of agreements. What have you done? Called it. <laughs> I mean, I've probably seen this like 10 times. Realistically. That few? Maybe not to. I mean, if you're going to call me out. I said that few. Oh. I said, uh, I thought you said have you. <laughs> Here we go. Lord all combat. Wow, they actually put the RAR in. You don't see that a lot. This has got to be his music. <laughs> Who are the fucking Wonder Twins right there? Yeah, that was funny. Girl's got a lot of fanboys. Please. So a prince, I guess. He's got his own theme song. It's a good idea. What are you gonna do? Oh, oh, my Maui chins! You sick son of a bitch! Look at the guy in the cut up flannel back there. <laughs> he got me my nuts. What do you want from me? This is inspired because they were doing, you know, uh, 
they would ask people, what do you want for the Mortal Kombat movie? Mortal Kombat movie. We're making a Mortal Kombat movie. You know, they do uh, screenings with uh, the audience, you know, kids, to okay. see what people would like to see. And the number one question, they're like, oh, does anyone have any questions? And the number one question that came up was, what do Goro, Goro's nuts look like? It just keeps coming up. Yeah. They're rock hard. <laughs> there's four of them. Oh, there's three. That's a funny number. There's I wonder, three of them. I wonder who those twins are that kept showing in this. Uh, no one? Yeah, it'd be great if they had been the Barbarian twins. Yeah, it would have. It'd be good to see them. But it literally order. showed them. That's the third time that, uh -huh. it's, that it's stopped on them. In very short order, too. Mm-hmm. Oh, that might be the guys inside the suit. Oh, okay. You switch out of those twins. Two of them. Yeah, there's two of them, so they don't have to do the whole thing in one day. Oh, that looks so bad. Oh, what? It just knocked him off the edge? No, oh, please help me. I have children. My dynasty. <laughs> so realistic. <laughs> you can't have it. She's mine. Jesus. Oh, I keep forgetting she was like a strong, independent woman. But that means that Raiden could go, I challenge you. I'm a fucking god. Let's do this, bitch. <laughs> Ew, it's Uki. No. The Emperor's asshole? <laughs> <laughs> Of course not. <laughs> no, don't. You know what they should have done? He just got up. She just got abducted. What's that? They should have got the guy that did um, Big Trouble in Little China to Which be Raiden. One? The lightning guy. Big just Trouble the Asian guy with the big head? Uh-huh. Just him, for some reason? He doesn't say one word in the whole goddamn movie. Because it would have been better than Christopher Lambert. Um, what is who, Lambert? <laughs> that's who Raiden's based off of, by the way. Oh, obviously. His stupid hat and everything. No, I think like the, the producers even should admit it. Like, we thought this character was great. Yes, let's have, let's have this electric. He says nothing. He does like two things in the whole fucking movie. He gets rather upset. Uh, I think he's got that big fight scene at the end, right? He fights the, the, the good Asian kung fu guy. Yeah. What do you mean you could deal with this? What's so hard? Why? You don't know that. Ugh. Not only does it look like a cartoon, but again, they're going to have to climb a 2,000 foot vertical wall. <laughs> Maybe okay. there's elevators. I'm ready to fight. There's somebody inside that statue. You don't think they have elevators here? No. You know or, why? Because they don't even have electricity. Look at how many fucking fires they have for everything. Huzzah. Nothing. Let me back up slowly and act like I have no idea what I'm doing. Well, you gotta at least grab its mouth because you know it's gonna spit your face. Or claw you. Especially since it's got big claws on its legs. Yeah. So this is weird, too. So, what, like, any statue is just gonna do this? It's the outer world. You assume that's a statue. I do, actually. You're right. 
Here we go. Statues happening. Reptile. <laughs> it's the reptile song. It's a Matrix but in here. This is a precursor to the Matrix. Huh. Yeah, uh, not really. Um, oh, come on. Those guys were so into electronic dance music, there's no way they were not influenced by this fucking movie. This is like a song the, 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 the Matrix. The, the Wachowskis, I shouldn't say guys, excuse me. But the Wachowskis are so fucking influenced by electronic dance music and stuff. Clubbing. You can say guys. Guys is universal. That's true, but it might be seen as... Uh, as uh, you didn't mean it that way. I didn't, but... So yeah. people need to get thicker skin. Well, well I'm sure they're not going to be offended by it. But what do you mean there? <laughs> the Wachowskis? I can't say they now. <laughs> what the fuck? Is that too PC? Is that not PC enough? I'm not sure which way it's supposed to go. I'm not actually sure what PC stands for. I thought no. it was personal computer. Penis quadrant. Even though quadrant's with a Q. That's <laughs> how I spell quadrant. Penis cubed. Penis squared, but with a C. <laughs> Wait a minute, what? Something to do with penises. Personal penises? That's yeah. <laughs> not PC. <clears throat> He's really good at just like working in with his environment. Ow. <sighs> Double kick. So I don't understand why that statue absorbed him and then this guy came out. It was too much a statue. Why? <laughs> it's the outer world. That was a good catch. That's why maybe people shouldn't leave the ground when fighting. <laughs> you killed my brother this is a new body you gotta give Riptile a little respect here at least. right and he loses a lot of his stuff he can't turn invisible he doesn't have his claws he can't spit just apparently regular spit since he already spit in Kane's eyes and it didn't do anything but you get what I'm saying Yeah. at this point he's just an Asian man I was not no, prepared well for this fight. Yeah. <laughs> what is happening? It looked like he did that on purpose. It's what? a statue. It's obviously a statue. I don't understand. Fate child of flawless victory. <laughs> Who are you? Who are you again? Come with me. Where's Johnny Cage? Who? Why didn't he help during the fight? He's like, wow, he's really getting his ass kicked. <laughs> Watching him fight alone? He's probably mingling with the uh, town folk. Is Oh, this is probably that thing you were talking about. Look at how big this is. And it looks like rubble, and it's all on fire. Oh, yes. That's a set? Yeah. That's a pretty cool set. Yeah. It's definitely evolved... It's huge. Look at how far it goes. How much money do you think that costs to make? A bunch. It's like, it looks like it's individual bricks. They're, no, it's, no. That doesn't look like a real building. It's a bunch of cats tied together. <laughs> that that apple peach thing is <laughs> hilarious. That was pretty funny. That there was stupid too. Ago, whatever. They didn't even eat it. Like, no. it could have been, any, you could have made a fake peach. You hear those drums going wild? And pickles on drums. So what do you think he dressed her up like that? Do you think she dressed herself like that? Poorly green screened her in? Wearing what looks like human leather? I thought you were going to say Xena's outfit. What? 
Xena, the warrior princess. Oh, yeah. Okay. That's okay. what she looked like to me. Got a real Xena vibe. I don't, I don't hate it. Hmm. You know, for a movie called Mortal Kombat, based off of the, one of the most controversial fighting game series of all times, you'd think it'd be a little more action-packed. PG-13. That seems like a weird call. At this least, is before they thought they could make look at she, She's movies. not even wearing shoes. Somebody took her shoes off. This is before they thought they could make R-rated movies that would make a lot of money. I feel like I've seen him in a movie recently. Now look it up. The Emperor. Just tell him. Your friends are already dead. Marry me. We're already here. Could have been 47 around and I saw him in. Yeah. I, and his voice sounds really familiar too. I, I bet you it's from Rebels. Or yeah, one, of those. one of those. Star Wars Visions. There's a few of them on here. Yeah. He's Ancient Ren. In Star Wars Rebels. I'll fight your champion. I didn't think that robe would be a two-parter. It seemed like it'd be like a one-piece. Yeah. In Rebels. Never okay. heard of it. Why not have him sit there and watch? Okay. I don't know why I thought he'd be shirtless under there. It's yeah. probably made out of flesh. Probably got some laughs. Oh, here we go. This has a real, like, uh, what, what was that movie called? I don't even, Night at the Roxbury feel to it. Here we go. boo doo 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 boo Not only am I completely toned up, but I don't like music, so. That's because you're always disappointed when you find out what lyrics mean. Yeah, because I like I can't hear very well either. So I apparently make up a lot of lyrics myself. And then I'm like, oh, okay, that's cool. No. And then you hear the actual song and you're like, what? You put it on, you put you put the subtitles on, you're like, that's what? What? That that doesn't even rhyme. Do 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 Perfect transition, <laughs> I'm sure. Mortal Kombat! Flawless victory. <laughs> right? You may you know they're gonna, my own blood. You know they're going to say flawless victory even though he's already taken an ass whooping. Yeah. Jesus Christ. I do love that hair though. That's kind of what I'm going for. You mean the eyebrows? Not Shang Tsung. Oh. Liu Kang. That one, there <laughs> it is. You mean the, the Asian mullet? <laughs> okay. Did you full screen it? I think it's again. I don't know how all of a sudden that is full screen, but how all of a sudden for somehow just maybe. I guess Jake can't stop putting his feet up on the desk, and every time he does, he fucks something up. I can't. Yeah, help just it. back up. And it's Leon that's doing. 
Here we go. That is literally the Asian mullet. Well, whatever it is, I like it. Rawr! So what does he keep these guys just like buried underground? I don't understand. I think it? he's summoning them through the like floor? they're defeated. I should, think they're defeated people, heroes that he's sh- stolen their souls. Or should something. he somehow? Should they come out of him somehow? <laughs> <laughs> right? Does he store his souls underground? I don't know. I like what orifice do you think they would have would come out of? Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> hey, it's like a taking a shit. Ah! 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 All right, now you have to fight this guy. The short dude is really stout. Ah, oh, that's that gonna hurt. I like how some guys just show up in like full armor with like a samurai sword. And yeah, some imagine, guy shows up with baggy pants. Imagine shitting that out. Oh. <laughs> Spiky samurai horns. Is this even allowed? Is this supposed to be a fight tournament between him and Shang Tsung? Uh, well, it's. He didn't even hit all those guys. It's part of his move, I guess. So we're our server. I'm up here now. Cool. Yeah, well, that means a lot to me. <laughs> I had a girl say that once. <laughs> that it was really endearing. I bet if you looked into my soul, you'd probably really like me. I like this jerk, right? You can't kill me. You've seen the true me. Who are you talking to? If I had a bunch of wishes, one of them would be sound effects. (laughs) Just at will. Yeah, so whenever I did stuff... Thank you. Turn your head. Action turn. It's that or like a theme music that just Ooh. plays in people's head and makes sure they're cool everywhere you go. Huh. All right, that's kind of a good one. I'm going to slightly modify mine so that it also includes theme music. So you're just going to steal Robert's thing? Well, no, it's also got sound effects. Sound effects are not music. That's Robert's thing. Well, that's why I said slightly modified. Because I'm going to add... By that, you just mean stealing Just a tag. Yeah. I will legally change it enough to make it a unique, original idea. And then take it. Judges? It's the... uh, It's it's American copyright law? Then, yeah. I think I'm okay. Mm. And again, he knows for a fact this is Shang Tsung. Yeah, I'd still probably give him a hug, though. You know, like one last check. Goodbye, brother. Oh, you smell so good. Gut punch. <laughs> right. Ah, you pulled my mullet. So is that supposed to be his older brother or younger brother? Or was he just younger than Liu Kang when he died? No, because he died right before this happened. Do you think he died in the last tournament? Yeah. I thought he killed this him. Was the, this was the last tournament. This no, was this number was 9 the and 10. 10. Yeah, right? This was the 10th tournament. So oh, you yeah. think his brother died last year in the last tournament? I thought they made it seem like his brother died right before this happened. They also made it seem like Shang Tsung went and hunted him out. And it wasn't in the tournament that killed him. He just slammed his face into the ground. A <laughs> flawless picture. <laughs> <coughs> I think it broke my fucking nose. Oh, you son of a bitch. Look at how high up his pants are. Is that a Liu Kang thing that I just didn't realize? He was wearing pretty hot pants. Bruce Lee thing. <laughs> that was just what was popular at the time. Now that was the slowest punch ever. <laughs> That's why he caught it so easy. I was like, what are you doing? They're coming out of your face, see? They come out of his face hole. <laughs> no! <laughs> no, I... Mortal Kombat. So, what kind of sorcery does 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 is he supposed to have in this movie? I think he's a shapeshifter. 
That's it? Oh, and he can steal souls, apparently. What good does that do? I think if you get beat up by somebody who's who's just physically stronger than you. Like, isn't that supposed to be a sorcerer's thing? They're not that strong. But their powers with their magic. I think a sorcerer thing, we were talking about this earlier in this very movie, is that a sorcerer is born with the power. As opposed to like a wizard who who earns it through knowledge or whatever. Well, no, I know, but a lot of good his sorcery does, because yeah, because he just he, ends up getting punched in the face a bunch. And yeah, I like these double punches, man. I can't get over that. Cha cha! He's just throwing his fists. Yeah, that's double punch. Pocket sand. <laughs> Look at how nice his hair is. It's fabulous. How bad they make Shinsun's hair like, <laughs> like, on his forehead, all sticky. That wasn't even a very good. You've got one spike. It'd be funny if he just missed all of them. Like his chest landed in the middle, and then like his feet somehow <laughs> missed the spikes. Ow, my eyes! You freed our souls, brother. I think I'm waiting for it. Okay. There's one of them that looks like he's having a lot of fun. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> oh, this freedom. That guy. <laughs> <laughs> that guy. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> he did look like he was having a good time. Hmm. Surprisingly intimate. Just wait for the kiss. I don't think you could just declare a flawless victory Maybe. after you've already taken an ass whooping and just be like, flawless victory. Wait, 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 wait. All right. Just like we got an hour. Woo! <laughs> Ride the wave. We. For anyone wondering, I, I I happen to have this off the top of my head memory of this song. This was also in Hackers. Oh, this is the theme song from Hackers. Pretty much, yeah. How do you guys even remember that? It's crazy, right? I usually just take credit for what he remembers. Well. I thought he was going to say Brazen. You did steal his uh, theme music idea. <laughs> hey! I slightly modified it. Mm. I just added sound effects to it. I then took it as my own. It's got to count for something. Mm. This is the theme song for Hackers? I don't, I don't remember that. Look at how cloudy it is right now. Okay. Nice, puffy white clouds. I like it when it's overcast. Well, I think it. I think in you get a cool breeze. No, there's no breeze there. Why is he so dirty? See now, look how. All right. Did we though? These are the same sound effects at the beginning. Oh, <laughs> gadget. For the emperor. Your soul is mine. Oh shit! Uh, 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 uh. This song rocks. This song does rock. Paul Anderson, huh? Why is that name so familiar again? In fact, my favorite part about this movie, this song. Oh shit! Son of a oh fuck! I'm gonna say Luke Kang's flawless hair. <laughs> what are you doing to me? What do you mean? Well, because you know, I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna say how. In keeping with the theme, Reptile was. It's probably my favorite thing. How well rendered and animated. I um, hate you. My second favorite is the practical sets. Yeah, yeah that's true. I place. should have said that. Yeah, I'm you should have said my first. Yeah, I'm going to change mine. I'm going <laughs> to change it to uh, the sets. Those big ass sets. I don't know if I told you, but they actually had airline pilots calling. 
Oh, I was oh, interesting. Uh, I was bored uh, right. today, and I was gonna watch. Scorpio. I was gonna watch Highlander. Oh, all right. And I was Got reminded that uh, I can't watch Highlander because that is going to be our next movie. You can't watch any movies unless they're comedies because they're eventually going to do them all. Every movie? Well, I mean, there's only a few hundred. How large can it be? I don't think you have that right. It's just like books. What is there, like 400 books? Worth reading? Probably. Oh, 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 oh. This music really makes you want to move. There it is. Like this. Is that rave moves? Is that this, what a rave is? Yeah. All right. This was Luis's patented move. Oh, I've seen him do that. He calls it the around the world. Yep. Whatever that means. It was a song that then why just are you literally doing said it around the world, around the world, around the world, around the world. If it was a song, why are you dancing like that? I'm dancing like that to this song. All right. Uh, 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 uh. Mortal Kombat. If I had to pick two favorite things, hmm, say Sonya's strong jaw. Something about that jawline, that potato jaw, really gets me going. All right. I'm sure she loves that compliment when she was a young woman too. Yeah. Probably. Wonder if your jaw's worse now. Your massive potato face. Wow. She is potato faced, for sure. The fuck is this? It sounds like filter. Filter. Power of two. That sounds kind of like nine inch nails or something. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> what the fuck? Who does this music? How do you go from so good to so bad? They have the goal. They should just play the Mortal Kombat song through the whole thing. Oh shit. You just speed it up and slow it down. You need a tender moment. You play it high pitch. You need some stoic, you just know, a sad song. moment. You sing it, play it slow. Mortal. Do, 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 do. This is like uh, the editor just like played some is like, oh, we got 20 minutes to fill at the end. Well, I got this band, Dogstar. <laughs> Everyone loves it so much. Uh. <laughs> Oh my God! I when I, I was bears for this when I, I I I was a kid. Okay. I remember David had this soundtrack, and he used to play it all the fucking time. Oh, I like the close credit song. I I I don't need your poison. Well, specific more specifically the uh, Mortal Kombat song. Well, that song's great. Yeah. You can't blame somebody for constantly playing that song. I feel like I'm going to buy it now and just play it over and over again. Soundtrack to your life. That's the music that you want people to hear in their head. <laughs> when I walk into a room. Oh, no. Oh, man. Do you hear that? <laughs> Everyone gets all And everybody would be like, what's that noise? And then I'd open the door and it would go, Mortal Kombat. And then people just start running at you to fight you. You walk in, it's like, Lou Kang. Flawless picture. <laughs> so <Sub> zero. <laughs> Did that guy just walk into the room and say Sub Zero? It's a Sub Zero. Is he a ventriloquist? Because I was watching his mouth didn't move. It sure sounded like he said Sub Zero. Jake walks in. Sonya. <laughs> hey, hey, big guy, your name's Sonya, huh? <laughs> you can be whoever you want here. <laughs> This is a safe space. I grew up in safe spaces. You don't even know. Your whole life is a safe space. 
I have coloring books that my dad's not allowed there. I, I, I don't need you. <laughs> I know, I miss that song now. This isn't any better. At least I had lyrics to make fun of. Yes. And a tone. And a guy didn't even sound like he was trying. Oh, shit. I like that cute. They actually character. did go to Thailand. Yeah, they went all over the place. That was what this was famous well, for. I, so I wasn't sure if I wasn't sure because a lot of the scenes almost look like they were green screen because they changed the background. No, they changed the, stuff the sky. On the beach was really in Thailand and stuff. Okay. The temple, right? That penis yeah, temple we were that talking about. That crazy island. Yeah, that weird ass island. Those islands are also there, I think, too. Or maybe Indonesia. That guy's name was Sanit uh, Lakham. Yeah, I'm sure it's spread out over Asia. Best boy. Best boy grip? How many best boys do they have? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is the remix. <laughs> the two versions of the same song. You really get your money's worth. Oh, yeah, some sort of just, they just pulled sounds from exactly. the movie. Exactly. I wish I could play this on the keyboard. Gary K, boy. Did you see that? Are you I'm even sure. looking at the screen? What are you doing? I don't have my glasses on. I can barely see the screen. I can barely <laughs> see 10% of what was on the screen. Nah, you're not missing much. Wait till you get to be my age, son of a You bitch. keep saying that. I don't think I'll ever well, look be at that. as you. Me, hollow populous. You hollow populous. You definitely need glasses. I read that name. Alan Rhinor. Name was David. What are you talking about? <laughs> Adam Adams. It. Look at that. All that's, right, you did that's see just... that. Technicolor. Wow. Could you imagine the parents that name their kid Adam? <laughs> Probably stage name. I thought you were going to say, can you imagine their people who name their kids Technicolor? Well, all right, here we go. The music. We all bleed red. All right, that's kind of cool. Where's Stabbing that? Westward. Never heard God, of they did a lot. Fear Factory. Twist a knife. Maple Where's Black. the actual Mortal Kombat song? KMFMD. Utah Saints take me on from the theme of Mortal Kombat. Is that the song? Is that, that what it's called? Cool. Nice. This this legitimately was like the first electronic dance fucking platinum soundtrack. Just 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 that, not like any caveat. No. Snake and inset actions were monitored by the American Humane Society. It's good to know they were there. Oh, uh, and they dedicated a movie to this jackass. I mean. They dedicated a shitty movie to that poor bastard. Yeah, that poor guy. <sighs> He'll be more famous for the dedication. Voices wailing. Whew. That was rough. That was a rough 90 minutes. Flawless, dude. <laughs> <laughs> but it wasn't. None of them were. All right, hit it up. Good night. Bye.